and they they did everything they did unto the presence of God to make sure that it was comfortable for his presence to dwell, to sit. And I feel like with worship leaders, it, it's, it would be so easy to um, forget that all the things we do, planning a session, Ableton, lighting, working with production, getting like picking the right set and getting the band on PCO, like all the things it, it could be so easy for us to forget. Like we don't do those things unto a senior pastor. We honor our senior pastor by doing them right. We don't do them unto our church. We do them unto the Lord. There were Levites who their job, their, their one job in their life was to twine rope for the tent so that it stayed, stayed up. Yeah. There's Levites who their job was to sweep up the incense that was previously burned. And I just feel like with worship leaders, what the Lord wants to do is mobilize an army of worship leaders who are focused and who are ready to go and who are saying, I'm, I'm a modern day Levite. My, everything I do is unto the presence of God to host and to dwell. Uh, there's Psalm 132. It says, I will not rest until I find a, a, a comfortable dwelling place for the Lord. And I just feel like that's what I, 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 if I could just hug all worship leaders, I'm like, let's do it. Come on. Like, let's, do it. <laughs> let's sweep up the incense. Let's, let's, let's wrap our cables. Let's like, let's, let's clean our stages. Let's, let's clean up our PCO. Let's get, let's get in order. And it's not because we want to be these little perfect little robots. It's because I, I want it to be excellent unto the Lord. And I want a comfortable place. I want him to dwell on our country. That's I want good. him to dwell over our churches, you know? Yeah, that's good.